Okay, so in this video I'm going to show a pretty basic sort of thing. It's uh, to do with gardening, and there I am blowing leaves. And this video is to do with leaves. It's about how to mow a lawn and uh, when you've got a lot of leaves on the lawn itself and particularly all around the edges and today is a very wet sort of not a very nice day but uh, this all video will also prove that you can mow your lawn when it's uh, a little bit wet so here I'm just um, blowing all the leaves into the center of the lawn as best I can so you just sort of go right around the edge and I've already whippersnipped uh, first so I basically turned the whippersnipper upside down and I cut finely around the edge there you can see the line that I made in the edge of the lawn and I'm just blowing the leaves into the middle of the lawn uh, ready to pick up or mow later on so as you can see there they're all being blown into the middle and the further away from this hedge the better so just get in under the hedge put the blower in there it'll blow them out of there like that pretty simple you'll never get them all but you certainly want to blow as many out from under there as you can get and yeah it's, it's um, you might have to do a few laps you'll never probably never get them all in one go so i always do a few laps but as you can see here, it's, uh, if you just blow them forwards, they kind of bounce, bounce their way back out. It's kind of like a technique that you just get used to after a while. But yeah, just blow into the hedge and it'll bounce them back out. The air blows them back out like that. So this lawn's surrounded by a box hedge. So um, yeah, as you can see, I'm just blowing it all out. Walk around the edge, pretty basic doing your best to blow all the leaves into the center of the lawn. And here you go, I think I'm doing my second lap now. Trying to avoid blowing the leaves onto the road. Try and blow them all inwards. They're just my ramps because I'm going to use, uh, just get my mower off in a minute and just show the difference between using a ride on mower and a push mower because not everyone's got a ride on mower much easier on a ride on of course however the general population will only have a push mower and of course you do need a catcher if you don't have a catcher you can still do it uh, but, it'll, but you will need to do uh, quite a lot of laps to mulch it up and then blow all the um, leftover leaves probably into a, a place where you won't see them anymore. I'm still blowing them all in there. And uh, yeah, once you've been around enough, uh, eventually all the leaves will be blown into the middle. And they will be quite thick. And because it's a wet day today, all the leaves are wet too, so it makes it even harder, but you can do it. If it's all dry, it's a bit easier. Probably don't want to try this on a really windy day. Although you can do it. And right here I go on my um, small ride on mower. Um, always face the discharge in inwards, so that the leaves obviously don't blow back into the garden. You want to blow them inward all the time. You always blow a lawn out to in if you want to do it the fastest and most efficient way. So as you can see, I'm going around the outside of the lawn and blowing them all in. And if you have the um, height of your deck too high, you'll probably have to do about two or three more laps than normal because it won't get all the leaves at once. If you go much lower, it will. Okay, so here we go with the um, push bowl now, and the catch is on, and just going in the same direction at first, as you can see the ride on didn't, didn't get all the leaves, it sort of shreds them and pushes them inward, but it will not pick them all up, no matter what you do, 
they will go somewhere unless you basically ride on mow for quite a while. So there they are, they're getting thicker and they're all heading inward. So just uh, continue mowing around there, filling up the catcher with the leaves. When they get a bit thick, just lift the two front wheels up a little bit and that will allow the air to needs my ride on there. I just left it there for now just to show this video. Because it's not every day you get a wet lawn that's covered in the leaves. So I thought that the idea come to mind to make a video just to show you how I pick up all the leaves to make the lawn look nice. And, and you can do this in rain. Um, it is a lot messier in the rain, but it surely can be done. So I'm going around there, always outside to him. In a minute I think I do show what it's like to do the other way. You can do it with a push mower, no problem. It's only if you don't have a catcher that you've got a, or a side thrower, you need to make sure which way you're shooting the lead. There you go, I'm getting there now. So yeah, getting there now and um, picking up the last few leaves. Yeah, just keep going around until you get them. As you can see there, I might have went over that already, but I might have, because it was so thick, you just need to keep going around. With the rain coming down on the mower, still going fine, still picking up everything. Just not as easy as if it's nice sunny weather. But yeah, just take extra work, that's all when it's wet. It's obviously uh, mowing all around, so I don't really get to pick and choose the weather. And here we are, back to the start. And I'm just showing there that uh, I've only got a few left to go and wonderfully magically they all just disappeared there because I finished mowing and you can see the ring down there where they haven't got and here, here I am just uh, picking up the rest so it doesn't really matter how you pick up the rest back and forward just like a vacuum and there you go all cleaned up looking much better yeah I just normally have a few buckets and fill them buckets up I like these ones uh, just because they've got the handle, 40 litre bucket. And then here just a light blow over because you'll find there'll be small leaves in the uh, grass. It won't, it doesn't hurt. Just just looks and just tidy it up a bit there. Always a few leaves left. You leave them on the lawn, the grass doesn't quite grow through that well. Yeah, just it's all just because it looks much nicer. Just give it a light while I have it in. And you go looking good. Nice looking lawn. And this is around the other side of the house. Just a small area. I've already whipper snipped around the edge, and there you go. I finished my one. Did that one quickly. There's the total amount of leaves I picked up. And uh, yeah, all done. So yeah, hope you uh, enjoyed this video and if so, thanks for watching.